Hey, thanks again for helping me set up. Are you kidding? Free chance to see Snoop? Of course. It's too bad Layla came down with the flu. You know, last time Snoop was in town, she was up on stage with him. I wish I could have seen that. Yeah. Hey, what about you? Are you gonna invite this new girlfriend of yours? Gotta be in here somewhere. Excuse me. Do you like this? <laughs> uh, definitely. <laughs> Danny may be fired. <laughs> well, remind me to thank her. Mm. I wish she was still crashing here. It was fun having my new sister around. Mm. I wonder how much fun Tay's having now that she forced Danny to move in with her. Margo, I... Work, okay. Sorry. But on the musical? Yeah. Sorry. No problem. Lang, um, is everything okay? What do you mean? But I feel like you're pulling away or something, or is that all just in my head? I wouldn't exactly call her my girlfriend, so asking her to see Snoop tonight, not gonna happen. You know, you said the same thing when I thought you and this mystery girl of yours should double with me and Layla. What's that about? Uh, the sitter just text. Oh, good. Shauna, right? No, she's not coming. What? Why not? She scored a ticket to Snoop Dogg. Well, what are we going to do? My, my mom has to be at Capricorn, and I don't want to ask my dad. Oh, what about your mom? She's on call at the hospital. What about your grandma? <sighs> She's ice fishing in the Adirondacks. Damn, that list of furs is long. We are never going to be able to find a babysitter at this time, and this was supposed to be our first date since we moved in together. Hey, I don't know. I'm sorry. All right, it's really, really sucks, but look, on the bright side, hope's asleep. Langston and Marco are probably on their way to Capricorn. So we have the place to ourselves. I know it's not as exciting as new, but... It'll do. It will do. <laughs> I'm sorry if I've seemed distant. It's just... It's this damn musical. I have this massive case of writer's block, and it's killing me. Okay, I, I, yeah, I kind of figured that when you left in the middle of the night to go right at the library. And when Star's mom came over because Mitch Lawrence was after you and you weren't here, you don't want to know what I was thinking. I'm so sorry about that. I just need to get this musical out of my system. Maybe you should take a break. <sighs> I've tried, trust me. I try so hard not to think about it, but it just keeps popping into my head every two minutes. And I just want to feel normal again. I just, I want to feel close to you again. Well, you will, babe, you will, come on. Look, we're gonna have a great time seeing Snoop Dogg tonight. I really think it'll take your mind off of this obsession for a while. So why are you keeping this girl a secret? She's not a secret, man. She's just not into the whole dating thing. Why not? Is she with another guy or something? <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, did you ever hear of knocking? Uh, we live here, and now you know what it feels like. Well, you don't have a bedroom with a baby in it. Yeah, well, we thought you guys would be already on your way to Capricorn. What are you still doing here? We're making the best out of a bad situation. Our sitter isn't coming, and now we can't find anyone else. I'll do it. I'm, I'll, I'll stay home. Her thing is her thing, man. I don't know. I, I, I don't feel right discussing I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to step in anyone's business. It's just that Layla keeps hounding me for, you know, gossip about it. And all I could tell her is that some girl like this scarf in your office. Yeah, well, she'll come back for it one of these nights. We were just talking about how you need to take your mind off of the musical. Yeah, but, I mean, I shouldn't be going out, not when I'm so far behind. I 
I'll just stay and watch Hope. It's fine. Come on, Langston. It's one night. Snoop Dogg could inspire you. You can write the first rap opera. Thanks, but um, I can't seem to get inspired ever since you guys won't let me write about you and Cole. Oh, so now you're going to make me feel worse by babysitting for us? No, it's just that I know I'm not going to be able to have a good time with this hanging over my head. Okay, then. Uh, I'll just stay home with you. No, don't. I mean, I know how badly you want to see Snoop Dogg, and he's only in town for one night, and I really need to work on this alone. You guys really would be doing me a huge favor. Please? Well, it, if it keeps you from running out to the library in the middle of the night again, then, yeah, I'll go. Listen, you mind taking over the door while I check backstage? Sure, what do I need to know? Rules are simple. You don't have a ticket, you don't get in. Except Star Call, of course. They get in for free. Play on this place, right? Oh, and the same goes for Marco and Langston. Hey, guys. Hey, Marco. Hey. Get your tickets? No tickets, no entry. I don't know if you know this, but my mom owns this hey, place. Mom, so. Check your chain, it's okay. Go on in. Very fun. Oh, and Star, uh, your mom has Langston down for a comp, too. Oh, she's not coming. Oh, she's not sick, is she? Yeah, my roommate lately has got the flu. No, she's fine. She's babysitting my daughter while she works on her play. Okay. Hey, Chris. You mind if I, uh, mind if I take off? I'm not feeling so good. Yeah, sure. Go home. I hope you didn't get Layla's flu. Get a fever? Maybe. I feel like I'm on fire. Hey, so where's Langston? Oh, well, we couldn't find a babysitter and she offered. What? She's gonna miss Snoop Dogg! I know, but... She wanted time to work on the musical. You know how crazy she's been about yeah. that lately. You know, going to the library at midnight. You know what, Marco? I got a really good idea. I think maybe you should go over and surprise me. is a really good idea. <laughs> well, then what are you standing here for? Get gone! Go, 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 go. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Marco, you shouldn't. Well, why not? Because Langston really needs to concentrate on the musical, and if she doesn't finish in time, she'll have a nervous breakdown. You think? Yeah. You know, just let her do what she needs to do. My stalker father actually tried to stop me from going out with you tonight. Can you believe that? Uh, yeah. He did the same thing to Star. He hates me. Well, you know what? He's going to have to hate me, too, because I'm going out with you. As long as you want to. Dad, please do not do to Danny and Matthew what you did to Cole and me. What are you doing here? You uh, left this in my office. Thanks. You alone? No. Is Marco here? Um, I have to get back to work. So, uh, bye. Hey, hey. You need some help with that musical? 